Hello everyone, welcome to SR Academy. My name is Dr. Sharif and today we are discussing about the model question papers. Model 1 we discussed so far, Model 3, uh, Model 2 we are going to discuss in this particular class. So in this Model 2 <coughs> we are having few more questions with the help of uh, notes we will see. The Model 2 notes is here. As I instructed, if you want to have notes, I cannot make it as publicly available. Please join WhatsApp link which is given in the description below so that I will give you some kind of a <coughs> task. If you complete those tasks, I can give you the, I can share notes with you. So module 2, <coughs> you will see. So module 3, now I hope you are, I have understood, you have got some out idea how the questions are framed, how the answer should be done. If not, please refer to my first video for which is done for uh, where we discussed about uh, syllabus and module 1 we have in in explained in detail. Okay. So, module 2. So, module 2, the first thing what we are going to talk about is the first thing, first question. With a neat sketch, explain architecture of brain versus CPU. So, your answer should be based on this thing. With a neat sketch, you need to speak about the architecture so you have to, have to talk about architecture so what is your first question uh, is implying okay don't you don't have to write anything from here so, because they have specifically mentioned architecture because when i see the students they are in hurry in exam hall they when the paper question paper they get they they, they want to write uh, no whatever they, have, they want to know whatever they have studied has come or not but they will forget to read some words. For example, we need sketch explain architecture of uh, brain versus CPU. But you read only brain versus CPU, and then you will start explaining about this particular note. I mean, topic that is brain versus CPU. But answer would be totally wrong. That will be you might get zero marks for that because the question was architecture. Okay, see architecture explain architecture of brain versus cpu so you have to speak about architecture only right so architecture in the sense this is the topic where you have to compare both the uh, cpu ka van women computing system versus brain computing system okay memory cells versus neurons how synapses happens and you can give so diagram might give you uh, two marks explanation might get you three marks so that will be your five marks okay next compare both brain and cpu based on their functions so now what we have to do now comparison both brain and this thing based on their functions so that means this is all about this topic so you write an introduction that might give you one or two marks here okay but the particularly this plays a very important role okay uh, the basic comparison between brain and uh, uh, computer you write down the basics basis of the comparison construction memory all these are functions of the particular brain or cpu you can just roll them and compare it, it with both of them okay so next uh, we are having the question which is <laughs> discuss about cns and pns with the need sketch that means equal impo importance is given to the both the topics cns and pns which will be having two and a half marks each so two marks for explanation of cns two marks for explanation of pns and you are having the for the uh, diagram you, you might have half marks for each so you'll be getting total one marks okay understanding so that's how we can go through okay next we are having signal transmission okay maybe question is there based on that yes explain and illustrate in the detail about so, so in detail means you have to write whatever is given but do not make it as very extra, extra thing only like it should not be it should be there for only five marks so see these all four points may, might get you two marks that means half marks a point this image uh, the draw diagram will get you one marks that will be three marks then th that can give you whatever you are uh, concluding that might get you one marks okay and this extra part is there no that might get you another diagram as one more mark so there might be 1.5 marks for this, 0.5 marks for this, whatever the remaining point, 2 marks and this the, this thing every point will have 2.5, 2.5 and 1.5 that will be our 5 marks. And next we are having the write a note on sketch on EEG with the what uh, mention its importance. See you have to explain with a neat sketch we have to explain is EEG but don't concentrate keep the, be there 
you have to write the importance and that means you have to mention its importance or applications so yeah, we have a uh, definition you have a little bit of introduction that might give you two marks the diagram might give you two marks i mean one mark okay that will be three then applications or importance its users you might get you one mark okay this also can get, get you one mark because five marks no small topic you just go through it next with a sketch of uh, uh, the need sketch uh, discuss about the robotic arms for processes so for that particular this thing you can go through the again uh, sorry, robotics so again it's by mars you give the two mars importance here yeah, the two methods are there direct control uh, through the muscle signals and as well as robotic arm prosthetics so see how much mars it is been asked so robotic mars it is asked for five mars so can you write all the things in the uh, this particular robotic arms no what you can do you can just mention you can uh, give the example of the robotics here introduction was one mark you might get and mention that there are two types are there direct control brain machine interface and mention this particular both the things and give only one one point so that means what exactly direct control through muscle discipline you just write it is from the muscles whatever the left muscles are there from there we are taking and draw this diagram okay one sentence one diagram over and the same thing goes for the next that is robotic arm prosthetic you just define what it is and one diagram so you are having two two marks understanding so half marks for your sentence and one mark might be yours per sentence one more for this thing and introduction one mark you are getting the five marks for this understanding and if it is asked for maximum marks for like eight or ten marks then you can in detail you explain all the points next enumerate engineering solution for and parkinson disease five marks are there so there are how many there are several engineering solutions are there majorly five marks so you have each one will get you one mark okay so diagram might get you that extra this thing which can help you to get a good marks so always go with reference if it is good time is there if the explanation is less and all next enumerate engineering solution for Parkinson's disease that we discussed write a note on artificial brain and mention application so we have to write the wrote a note on artificial brain so there are around three points i have mentioned here you mentioned that you might get two marks and you also compare with uh, the general intelligence with the narrow intelligence that might get, get you one mark so four marks done so next another two marks where you are going to give the closing remarks next illustrate and explain bionic eye with a neat sketch so you have to illustrate and explain what you have to illustrate and explain bionic eye with need sketch that means you are having the explanation is maximum that means four marks are there for explanation diagram one mark so here the most com components are there for components i component you can just explain okay and then you can with, the, with that you can just go comparison you can do with the retina or this thing okay so that will be your wait a minute sorry sorry i'm talking about bionic eye bionic eye is not this topic so we are having the different topic as a bionic eye can just go through here see bionic eye okay diagram will carry diagram you can just imagine and write the, uh, draw the eye and inside that you can make <coughs> kind of a machine or a camera see your materials are used might get you two marks and this diagram especially and how exactly things works so that plays a very important role that might give you two marks okay one mark explanation materials two marks and two marks for the how exactly it works Next, we are having the discuss about optical corrections of the eye. For that, uh, we have already discussed in the glasses. Okay, so you are having the optical corrections here. See, introduction. It will give you one marks. There are three different types of your refractive errors. That is myopia, hyperopia, astigmatism. That will give you one mark. So two marks over. The most common glasses used will give you that two marks. So two marks plus. One mark plus two marks. So here two marks, two marks, and one mark. So that will be optical correction can give you five marks. Next, with the risk at architecture of the rods. So here architecture of the rods is a little bit a big topic. Optical corrections along with the cataracta. So that is asked for your ten marks. I'll just highlight so that you got confusion here. So here two topics are asked. 
discuss about this and this so when it is discussed what is common to both the topics then those marks are evenly distributed that means five marks each optical mark. correction will carry five marks cataracta will carry five marks now i told you how the optical corrections will get uh, gets the five marks the same thing goes for cataract introduction for diagram one mark so two plus one and then closing remarks whatever it is there that will be for two marks so five marks so is done five plus five ten marks is done next you are going for this needs case architecture of the rod and uh, this thing that is the design of eyes so here it starts we have to start with from here so for here uh, since architecture of both the things are there for rod cells five marks consoles five marks so go for the explanation diagram so diagram will have one mark each so two marks for diagram explanation four marks each okay i mean three marks each that's how you will get the 10 marks next the news case explain about the architecture of the heart okay and uh, explain heartbeat that is a continuation okay so architecture of the heart you have to explain that we will uh, have studied recently this is the architecture of the heart here only it starts okay you, diagram is very important here two marks you can say one and a half marks or one marks both the diagrams you have to draw so two marks you will get for diagrams only and explanation the heart weight you will get for two marks so introduction one mark so total five marks okay so next we are having describe electrical and uh, electrical signal ecg monitoring and related issues so here ecg monitoring will be having three marks two marks heart related issues i will tell you how see ecg monitoring we are giving introduction and we are saying for what purposes it is using and this image all those things will be related to this particular uh, uh, what do you say the uh, ECG here we are having something called heart related issues this this thing this part will have two marks okay and this part will have one mark then again this two mark and then that will be your three marks and two marks will be given to the your image because it carries the three different uh, ways or three different these things how exactly the signal has been generated so normal fast slow or irregular heartbeat so that discussion takes a lot of time so that will be two marks is definitely for that next we are having discuss reasons of blockages five marks we have to discuss discuss in a sense you have to write there are around seven reasons are there your introduction will get half marks seven regions 3.5 that is four marks and closing remarks so whatever you are going to explain con conclude with okay what are the reasons that should be taken healthy diet diet this exercise avoiding smoking all those things if you are mentioning that will get you point one marks so that was about five marks next uh, we are having need sketch explain about stents in heart so stents in heart is very small topic uh, explanation will give you two marks here but the diagrams will give you five or uh, three marks why because balanced stent versus self-expanding stent so half uh, one marks uh, one and a half more for marks for each okay because in the explanation only in the diagram only explanation is there you can also explain this okay first step what happens here it is mentioned as delivery of this thing so like that those are the steps so that's why i'm not given in theory sub separately next we are having the pacemaker so pacemaker this today only we studied that is pacemaker that might will get you 10 marks so 10 marks in the sense introduction here whatever you are getting two marks the image is a two to two the images this particular image will give you two marks because here components are there everything is being need to be mentioned there the mark just diagram is not won't give you marks any marks you have to mark the the, the uh, components okay next basic design will give you one mark and pacemaker can be designed in three different ways will give you one and a half mark and that will be around uh, five and a half next this image might get you one and a half marks because there are three sing channels are there single dual and this thing so 0.5 each so that will be your eight marks and then finally construction of pacemaker that is a general procedure that will be for two marks there are only four things are there to explain so 0.5 each so that was about 10 marks for the face maker understanding so next we are having the brain as cpu that here 10 marks so full question it is okay so in this model three 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 topics are there brain i brain as a cpu i as camera and uh, heart as pumping system all these three questions can be asked for 
10 marks that means during that time you should be very smart and when answering this so you cannot answer every seven topics all the seven topics right so what you have to do you have to give a more importance to the introduction so do you almost you write all this in brain as cpu topic and comparison all these things will will give you five marks still here now you are having all others uh, subtopics like architecture of the brain is there how uh, and cns pns is there okay and then uh, signal transmission is there okay all these things are there pick any one topic for example signal transmission you pick so which is common in cpu and as well as this thing then keep comparing in brain the signal transition happens here like this in cpu it uh, it, uh, it happens in other way like that you can keep on explaining that how that you will get your 10 marks that what about this then the next just um, camera as i as a camera that also same thing so i you need to give a brief introduction about i as camera okay so explain how exactly it works this is the first topic first thing only will give you five marks the rest of thing you can just take an example this is see cone cells and rod cells it give so that is ability to differentiate colors where the camera also does the same thing or you can give the cataract this lens correction lens materials or every topics ka two two points you can give so that 10 points will be there so that will give you the 10 marks understanding so next heart as a uh, uh, how heart acts as a pump system explain same thing goes for heart also you cannot explain everything so make sure what is required need to be explained okay so you need to explain this first uh, topic always which is it acts as a very introduction that is heart as pump system explain how exactly pump that will get you five marks rest everything will be five marks okay so that was about the module two uh, question bank so module three question bank we will discuss in the next